My name is Rodrigo Constanzo and I'm some dude. <laughs> <laughs> Just like you can compose on paper, you can compose with a lead sheet. It, 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 it's a kind of notation of sorts. I've programmed the system such that I can deal with graphics, text, um, traditional notation, and sort of moving image. Although it isn't anything like a movie per se, but I can deal with sort of moving graphics to a certain extent. And you can send each one of these types of information. You can use all of them, you can use some of them, you can use any of them, any combination of them for any of the, the, the performers. Okay, so with this, this piece, so if both of you go full screen, you're just going to get text prompts on the screen. The big center area is what you're doing now. Already implemented in the system is, is um, feedback from the performer. So at the moment, the performers can engage with what's happening. And it, it takes, it's up to the, the sort of master program or the composer to take advantage of that. But they can send, at the moment, um, text feedback. So they can hit spacebar, enter key, and number keys, and things like this. Eventually, I plan on adding additions where each individual computer, in addition to Displaying information is also analyzing audio locally, so you can have a, a, an analysis stream coming back to the master computer that they can take, let's say, pitch or rhythmic information from each of the computers and use them compositionally. Live. Live. Mm. So fundamentally, the, the system uses laptop computers at the moment. Eventually, it'll be using iPads and, and other displays, but it uses a computer, and each performer will have their own dedicated computer. And then there's a, a server that runs on the master computer, and then there's a router that all the computers are connected via. Yeah, well, it's, sure. it's, it's a protocol, so it's, it's similar to MIDI in that it, it's, it's just so you can send it. I'm, I'm using Max as the, the, the main programming language. But you can send it from a web interface. You can send it with from pure data. You can send it from an Arduino. Like anything can send OSC messages. So you can conceivably just have your Arduino generating a score and spitting it out to everybody. It's sort of designed with that kind of openness in mind. For me, one of the big motivations and interests in this is that it'll allow a kind of creative thinking, I don't want to say compositional thinking, but it'll allow a type of creative thinking that falls somewhere between composition and improvisation, which is generally where I work creatively anyways. It'll allow you to think in, in sort of forms that are open, but not open at the same time, and allow for, for types of, of creative thinking that, that aren't possible without this kind of technological system behind it.